Hi, Tim from TakeoverPage1.com. Thanks for joining me today. Wanted to have a chat to you today about software automation. I've had lots of people writing into uh, us recently talking about the merits of totally automating their efforts, uh, internet marketing efforts, using uh, software. So in other words, getting a software program to actually create content, uh, you know, create content articles, etc. for your website, getting uh, software programs to actually uh, upload or, or to create accounts at those uh, Web 2.0 sites, you know, such as Squidoo, uh, creating uh, email accounts, creating social bookmarking accounts, etc. And then also using a program to actually upload the content. So the idea being is you just uh, you know, click a button effectively and uh, you're on page one and you're making lots of money. Uh, and uh, you don't have to do any work. Well, I just wanted to spend a bit of time talking about that because uh, quite frankly, uh, quite frankly rather, uh, I think you guys have been conned. It's not that it's not that easy. It's not that easy to get uh, you know these type of results that we've been getting in our memberships purely using software. I'm a firm believer in software. I've been a software develop, developer for over 20 years, uh, and I love software. But I don't think you should be using software to totally automate your internet marketing efforts. Lots of reasons why. Let me give you an example. A few years ago, uh, before I actually got you know really heavily involved in internet marketing. Uh, I was actually involved in a major Web 2.0 site, uh, and I was actually the sof software coder, or one of the coders, as part of a team that actually looked for uh, software uh, bots, if you like, so automated programs that tried to do things automatically, what people did manually. Because it's the, the thing is, with Web 2.0 sites, they don't like software automating uh, content, you know, automatically uploading content, automatically creating accounts. Because Web 2.0 is all about people, it's all about um, interacting with other people, it's not about automating and um, you know just drilling it down to the stage of just being an internet marketing product. Anyway, long story short, generally speaking, software uh, automation is fairly easy to detect. Now, I've actually got an article on my blog, on our blog, uh, that we've actually talked about that in detail. So if you go to www.takeoverpage1.com forward slash blog. You can have a read of that uh, at your leisure if you wanted to. But the point I'm making is that it's you know usually fairly easy to detect uh, programs that actually create content and programs that actually you know, create accounts and uh, programs that actually upload information. And what tends to happen in many cases is that uh, the software or the, the outcome, the Web 2.0 sites that you get set up uh, get deleted over time content gets deleted uh, as these programs uh, of which I was writing them a few years ago for a major web 2.0 site when we find them uh, when we find the content and again bearing in mind it's fairly easy to find you lose it con their content so your content will get banned um, at worst uh, at best rather and at worst your entire account will get deleted so long story short is you're putting your efforts into just something that's probably not going to last in the long term and it means you're wasting your time. Long story short, you're wasting your time and money. Now, I do believe, as I said earlier, in software, being a software developer, and I think there are aspects of, uh, of internet marketing that can and should be automated. I get concerned when people write into me to say that they've been actually uh, you know, running programs that totally aut automate this function, and they're finding the results don't stick, and they're asking, you know, what can they do to uh, uh, fix the problem? Well. The solution is simple, don't automate. Don't actually try and do, do this 100% of the time. You should be uh, trying to be a little bit uh, smarter than that and actually you know, producing your content, putting your unique spin on things and not relying on a computer to do the work for you. Your computer is there as a, uh, as a help, as a way to help you get to your goals. It shouldn't be the sole means to do it. It shouldn't be used, uh, in my opinion, uh, as the sole way to get there because it's uh, you're going to find you're not going to get the results that you're really setting out to achieve. I really think you need to take the time to learn how to, to, uh, to do these things manually yourself. I think that's very important because if you're relying on a software product to, to do all the work for you, well, what happens if the programmer decides he needs to take a holiday? What happens if uh, you decide to cancel out of a membership of that program site, or the site that's actually offering that software product? Um, you're not going to get any support. The program's probably not going to work anymore. And you know, what happens to all your existing content? What happens to future content? So it's really something you need to think about. Think about the short-term strategy, sure, of getting some, some content up, but also the longer-term strategy and where's your content going to be in six months' time. I think a far better way of uh, 
proceeding is to actually understand how to do it manually and, and you know, learn how to do it, learn linking strategies, learning how to upload content manually, learning how to create accounts manually. It really gives you uh, or puts you in the box seat so that you know perhaps later on you can start looking at outsourcing, uh, getting other people to do some of this stuff for you or using you know, some software programs to automate some functions, just not the whole thing. So you know, at uh, takeoverpage1.com, we teach our members first and foremost how to do things manually. We also show them how to outsource, that is to get other people to inexpensively uh, do some work for you, effectively like a, a virtual employee, if you will, very, very inexpensively. And it really means that uh, you don't need to get software to automate your entire, uh, you know, internet marketing efforts. It makes more sense to you. You know, you're more in control, is I guess the point I'm trying to make here. So I think I'm rambling on a bit, so I'll stop there now. I suggest you do take the time uh, after this video to click on the link and go to takeoverpage1.com and you'll see that we've got a membership site that teaches you not only how to get massive web traffic and uh, for those guys who know Alexa, just have a look at our Alexa ranking. We're, we're sub uh, 100,000 now, which means takeoverpage1.com is among the top 100,000 sites on the entire internet in terms of the amount of web traffic it gets. So that's some indication to you that we know what we're talking about and we're able to teach you that as well. So not only can we teach you about how to get great web traffic, but as a result, uh, but we can also teach you how to get great uh, rankings as well. All explained on the webpage, go and have a look. Uh, the other thing you can do, if you go to the link www.takeoverpage1.com, that's the information about our membership site. However, there's also another site, which is our blog, and you just go to www.takeoverpage1.com forward slash blog and you can find a heap of free content. We've got heaps of free videos, we've got free software because again, we're developers. And uh, get in there and read our 10 free tips ebook. Lots of information for you to learn how to do this stuff manually. I really think that uh, down the track by learning to do this stuff manually, you're going to thank us because you've got to realize that uh, you fully understand the process of how. Uh, internet marketing works and more importantly how to get web traffic and it puts you in a great position that if you decide you want to automate uh, your internet marketing efforts down the track you know how to do it manually you've got something to fall back on if that software program stops working all right i'll leave it there for today thanks for taking the time to listen to my ramble i just feel very strongly about this because uh, as i said at the start of the video there's people have been uh, emailing us and writing into us uh, you know, being a little bit worried that uh, they've used these uh, complete software automation tools and initially got some good results and then found that uh, the results, you know, the accounts are getting deleted, the content's going down, they're losing their rankings. Well, that's why, because they're putting all their efforts, they're relying on a computer, which is essentially a dumb bit of, uh, you know, electronic circuits, and they're relying on the programmer uh, to have actually thought of every possible scenario because computers can't think like humans can. All right, I'll leave it there for now. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Cheers for now.